Who did your hair? I did. Welcome back to Lima Bean Living. If you guys are new here, my name is Emily. Welcome to my motherhood channel where I take care of all things mom. Today, I went to the store with the kids just to pick up like some tortillas and a little diffuser. Uh, it's, this one's from Dollar Tree. And I ended up getting the tortillas from Dollar Tree too because mm -hmm. I kind of compared the prices and it, it was comparable. So I just got my tortillas from there. Perfect. And uh, then we, you know, got some more stuff. My sister-in-law gave us a gift card for Christmas and it was a fun little outing. So we are gonna show you guys what we got at Dollar Tree today in a little haul what? video. So Aubrey got to pick out some things as part of her Christmas gift, but then she also brought some money and she purchased some of her own items. So Aubrey, why don't you tell our channel what some of, are some of the things that you bought? I got some beautiful pink flowers and this one I got another one before but I just wanted to get two, so I got on uh, one. Oh, okay. And then this thing, I told we got instructions there. Oh, they have instructions? Okay. See, we can make a mix saw or the moon or this. I think that's called a rocket or a swing. And what do you, what do, you do with it? We make the shape like pink, so we got ones. And what was the story behind it? Why did you want to get that? Because there's a come room and had it, so I finally got it. I told you we had this, this, but I told you we had this now. You totally have this now. And then this, I got this. And what does that do? We can put on our head like that. And then this we can eat because they're the only candies. And then this I got pink ties. And then this I got pink pom-poms and they're beautiful. And what are we going to do with the pink pom-poms? Put them in my room and then these hearts. When it's a party, totally we can do this, but then we get one of these ones. Oh, wait, say that again? We're totally going to use these? Mm -hmm. These ones are totally usual ones. The ones that don't have them, but these ones these are perfect, yeah. Wait, so they, you... yeah, if we throw a Valentine's Day party, I thought that these were really cute. They have like glitter on the inside. Obviously, you're probably gonna have to like hand wash these. I don't know if these would be like good to wash in the dishwasher because they are plasticky and if you have something run too hot, maybe it'll warp or I don't know. But I thought that they were cute to put little candies out for a party or something. Oh, yeah. All right, so I think the rest of the stuff was stuff that I picked out, right? So we got some little garden gnomes for the fairy garden that my sister-in-law made mommy, for our Christmas gift I mean, exchange. Mommy, you got more of stuff and I got more. Yeah. I like the little things that like scratch off and have color underneath. And so they had some St. Patrick's Day and stuff. So I thought that this would be just a cute little activity and when that day focus. comes. We also got these. Mom got two of them. Yeah. That so So these are little pots for St. Patrick's Day. But I actually thought that they would make really cute, like gift, not bags, but you know, like little things to give away if you have like a Halloween party. So I wasn't sure if Dollar Tree was gonna sell five packs of these cute little pots um, at Halloween time. So I decided to pick up two sets so that I would have enough to like give away to kids if I end up hosting like a Halloween game night or something like that. At least then, you know, you put a little bit of candy in each one, or you could put like a tea light. Um, or just like even if you wanted to stock up and have this be your Halloween treat for everyone who comes in, put, you know, like two or three little candy bars in there and each person gets a little pop. So that is why I got these. It could be premature. They might sell the same exact thing at Halloween, but I don't want to risk it because they are so cute. And then these mommy told me that for me. No. Well, kind of. So I saw a craft online 
that you get these little fabric gift bags and they had some bigger sizes but I thought this small size would be good enough. And you iron on like a little tic-tac-toe game and you can put someone's name on it and then you use some table scatters like here are like lips and hearts in red and like diamonds in kind of like a whitish clear and you can use those as your X's and O's like red and white. So I just thought that this would be cute. I got a three pack of the small bags and I figured if we have another kid, you know, I can do one for Aubrey, one for Jack and have one for a future child or, you know, maybe I'll just make it like just standard, no names on it and we'll just give them to like each of our families with children. Another thing that I thought was cute from Dollar Tree was they have these scratch stickers. I have bought some online, like a bulk where it's just a small circle, like the size of a quarter but these are a little bit larger, so you could write like a little letter and make your Valentine's Day card, you know, extra fun with like a little scratch off to reveal the message that you write. So I just grabbed one of these because I thought that this would be cute to have on hand. Kind of sticking with the Valentine's Day theme, I like to get these little pop balloons just to kind of have on hand if we get together with like a family friend who has a kid or something and it's like around Yay. Valentine's Day. It's just a fun little thing to give to them. And then uh, these little cute little uh, wooden sticks with some hearts. I noticed one is kind of broken so I should have been more careful in selecting mine. But they just look like the little like candy hearts without messages on them and I thought that they would make really cute little skewers for you know, the tops of uh, cupcakes or some other little treat. You know, you could stick them in a drink if you really want to. So like I mentioned before, I actually went to the Dollar Tree to pick up one of these little diffusers. I've noticed that like they really help with keeping the bathroom smelling clean and we have one in our master and I wanted to get one for our guest bathroom as well. It is kind of cute, you just press the button and then when you're done, you know, like when the smell is gone or whatever, like you can turn it off but you can just have it running. You don't need water, you just need some batteries. And I've noticed that it works pretty well in like a small space for like a bathroom. So it's kind of like a, you know, push the button before you go. And then when you're about to leave the bathroom, you can turn it off. And I think it works really well at keeping the bathroom smelling fresh. And then I picked up some more of these uh, baskets. I really like how sturdy they feel. And I just want to like organize some new furniture that we got for our like kind of kitchen area. And I think that these are gonna fit perfectly. Before I totally wrap this up, the one thing that was funny is like this table scatter is totally soaked in saliva because Jack was like sucking on this. And then I was about to like finish paying and I was like, oh my gosh, wait, like I haven't paid for this thing. It was like all slobbery. And I was like, do you want me to scan this for you? Because it's kind of gross, but the lady was holding, like wearing gloves and you know, it, it was fine. The man behind us was like, oh, I love kids. This is fun to watch. <laughs> so anyways, that's why this like does not look nearly presentable, you know, for this video. So that's just because it's covered in Jack slobber. So anyways, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Aubrey is very eager to eat some of this candy, which she needs to pay me a treat ticket for. And uh, if you guys are new here, I'd love for you to stick around and subscribe and catch all of my motherhood content. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Do you want to do the elves? Do they live in here on the wood? They can. Everyone can because it's the elves birthday. Oh. So they're having a mushroom party? They're gonna eat that much room cake. <laughs> <laughs> and who did your hair? I did. You look beautiful. And the ladybug fried. And I wanted to eat some. And the ladybug go back. Okay. to the end of the video. If you didn't know already, every Monday and Friday, you can find motherhood and lifestyle content on this channel. And since us moms have to do it all, that may mean yummy recipes, easy DIYs, mom hacks, cleaning and organization, or just a combo of everything. Please know that you are loved and you are made for greatness, and I will catch you in the next one.